Okay, in the Tesla, if you hit the uh, menu button in, under entertainment, so entertainment pulls up the game menu. This is the arcade, and it's got several games to play. Um, only a couple of them are really fun, like this beach buggy uh, racing number two is pretty fun. It requires a controller, but you can also use the steering wheel of the car. So you can use the steering wheel, you can use the brake pedal. This is just giving you kind of a warning here. But we'll get into this and show you how this game works. Okay, here we're just going to use the touch screen to get started. Uh, you just here you just choose your player. Choose whether you want to choose your difficulty. It loads. Okay, so instead of using this touch screen to drive, we're going to use the steering wheel. And you just use the steering wheel as you would, and you can use the regular brake pedal to brake. controller or you can use this, the touch screen to kind of remove the car this was probably the probably I think this is probably the funnest game on the uh, available right now and we have an Xbox controller this is a wireless one but if you see here you can plug in a this is just a micro USB connector and then you just plug it right here this is in a Model X just plug it in, in right here if you had two controllers you could plug them both in one thing that we did this is the second cable that we tried. We tried one before, we couldn't get it to work. This just kept flashing. See how it's, uh, this is all white? That means it's connected. So if you plug in your wireless connector or your wireless controller and it's blinking, try a different cable. This is our second one we tried and it's now working. So now we can play this game uh, with the Xbox controller and we don't have to go buy a wireless one or anything. We can just use it with this one here. So this one has the option to either play with the controller, you can play on the screen, touch screen, or you can use the steering wheel to control it, which is kind of cool. You use the steering wheel and the brake pedal to steer and brake. So, all right, show us how to play. It. Show us uh, playing on the Xbox controller here. Oh crap! I did two player. So tell us. Do you know what the controls are? Yeah, I think I think it's list to drive. Maybe. Or it's like, I know one of these is probably to drive and the other is probably to break or something. Oh, okay. Um, oh, yeah, so this um, RT is how you go. Um, LT is how you... No, LT is LT's how you break. break. Yeah. Except you have to let off the... the oh, the accelerator? Yeah, you have to let off the... Actually, you don't actually need to accelerate. It just goes automatically for yeah. you? It's already accelerating? Yeah. And then steering controls just with the joysticks. The just joystick, right? Which one do you... Oh, you don't use the... Yeah, this. Okay, so you just use the toggle joystick. All right. And then if you wanted to do it by hand, you didn't have a controller, you didn't want to use the steering you wheel. You just press those. You just press the arrows, you would press the brake, you would press... What's this? What's this uh, tire there? Um, it's a boost. Okay, you got a boost. There's other game called Cuphead. This one you have to have a controller plugged in. When your controller is plugged in, so again we have the Xbox controller plugged into the USB here. But when it's not plugged in, it will not let you. Yeah, it will, you can't play it at all, so this one needs a controller. So plug your controller in with, and now we can go to play game. And we're using the Xbox controller only because that's what we had. Like we have an Xbox and this this cord here, we had that, so it makes it easy. You don't have to buy buy a separate or different controller. Yeah. If you're gonna buy one, I would recommend buying one that already has the cord on it. You can just leave it in here. Yeah, if you're just gonna use it for this. Yeah. Okay. 
All right, he's walking around here. But maybe it's fun the more you get into it. It seems like it like takes a while to play. Oh yes, this kid. Okay, so you're killed. Uh, the game, the racing one's a little funner. This one might take a little getting used to. Okay, there's a bunch of older games, old arcade games like Atari type games. This is Millipede. We're just testing out. Is the does the controller work on this one? I don't know. Are you the spider? What are you? I'm not the spider. You're supposed to shoot that thing, right? Yeah, but I can't move. Huh. I died. Oh, you got to be able to shoot. See how I'm shooting? Yeah, yeah, the con the, this controller doesn't. It's not. The controller is not Working. controlling that. So maybe the X the Xbox controller. I don't know if it's just the Xbox controller or in general. Yeah. It doesn't look like it controls this. That's game. how you at least hook up an Xbox controller to your Tesla. Uh, either get the wired version. You know, if you're going to buy an, a controller, get an Xbox wired one. Those are pretty cheap. If you already have a, a wireless one like we do, just get the... It's a micro USB cable to USB cable right here. Just plug in right there. That's where you would... That's where you'd be... Uh, that's how you connect them. Anyways, thanks for watching the video. Be sure to like and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one.